Hey guys, well, I'm back in the snack aisle. Um, so I was just talking um, to uh, Kelly about this and she said she used to get raisins and craisins and stuff like that for um, snacks. So I just want to show you a couple things. So the raisins basically are like eating candy. Um, so one serving, which is one quarter cup, which is not very big, of raisins is um, 32 total carbs with two dietary fibers. So that's 30 grams of carbs in one small serving. There's other stuff to snack on. Um, this says total sugars are 29, includes zero added sugars. It's sugar in your body. Your body doesn't care if it comes from a raisin or if it comes from a candy bar. Sugar in your body is sugar. So any of the dried fruits, any of those dried fruits are going to be high in um, carbs. So what I do is I like to snack on um, almonds. Um, you can buy them in individual packages. You can buy them in big packages and make individual packages. This is one of my favorites. I love salt and vinegar. Um, they have all sorts of different flavors. Um, so I want to show you this one because we all think that chickpeas or hummus or things like that are good for you. Well, chickpeas are, are still high in carbs. So for one serving, which is one quarter cup, um, it is total carbs is 18 grams, and then dietary fiber is six grams. So you do get to subtract that, but I don't want to spend my carbs on chickpeas. I'd rather get sunflower seeds or oh, almonds. Lady. That's my husband again. <laughs> um, really uh, good snack, pistachios. Um, almonds, you're going to want to keep an eye on things like cashews because cashews are a little bit higher in carbs. You want to make sure and watch your servings on those. Um, if you are getting beef jerky, beef jerky can have added sugar. Hmm. Everyone wonders why we like it. It's all sweet and tastes good. So make sure that you're checking the label for the ones that have the least amount of sugars or carbs in them. Um, and then obviously, um, chips, corn chips, these kinds of things, we're gonna go past those. There's some pork rinds, get this from Kelly. Um, but even like uh, pita chips, um, uh, these are hippies. I don't know what hippies are, um, but they're you just have to look at the label and make sure that they're not high in carbs. If they're high in carbs, you probably want to stay away. It all depends on what your goals are. So, and popcorn. Popcorn. It's high in carbs. For one cup, which I can't eat just one cup of popcorn, it's 14 grams of total carbohydrates, one gram of fiber. So you've got in this one... Oh, this one's honey barbe honey butter too. Don't do that. Oh, that was a mixed one. Let's see, this is just popcorn. It should be a little bit better. Let's do just popcorn. Um, so in one serving size is one one ounce. It says four cups. I don't know how that works. Um, but there's 20 grams of carbs, three dietary fiber. So per serving of just popcorn is in for that one I'd have to look at the rest of them is uh, at 17 grams of carbs so just a few things make sure that when you're going to the store when you're deciding to make a change that you um, that you're looking at all of the labels so we'll hopefully get some more ideas for you I just went to the gym that's why I look like this bye everyone <laughs>